Hello everybody and welcome back to more Crystal Catacombs. We are on episode 2. We're going back to the Lost Jungle. We didn't do so hot last time, but we did much better than I was expecting for the first episode of a explorative Let's Play. Um, like if you guys are familiar with any like episodes of like people playing, I don't know, the only thing I think of is like, like the first thing I think of is like Northern Lion playing Binding of Isaac or something. If you're familiar with that kind of Let's Play, it's like learning as we go learning with me kind of stuff. I think it went really well, all things considered. And my attacks can break his little purple Cheerios. That is a good thing to... Oh, butts! Ah! I knew... I knew that that was the layout. I just was not thinking, I guess. Okay. Well, this is already not going as well as last time, but we know that that is the layout for the room now. All right. Oh, maybe not. I forgot that, that changes. Okay, there's... We got two goops, but we also have a nice layout for them. Because we can just swing from here. Alright. Bring this one to the ledge. Nice. Alright, we took out some... Ah, uh, I, I don't know if those go away. I know the coins definitely go away if you wait too long. I'm not sure about those. These guys, like I said, aren't too bad. They're ma mainly um, a problem if you're... Like, if I was falling down from here and I didn't know, I would, like, almost certainly take damage because he just... They jump. That's what they do. There's the jumpers. I guess that... I they I know they have other names um, because I saw on the developer's Twitter on the Levels for Lives Twitter. Go follow. Hello, LOL. LOL. <laughs> I don't know why I did that. Um, I really don't know why I did that. But, uh... Levers at levels for life. Eh, at levels for lives. They tweet some pictures of the the artwork of the characters with the names of them. What I or what I believe are the names of them, and uh, maybe I'll have to read up on that, or maybe we can just keep on giving them my our own lingo. <laughs> oh, we already got our key. Or already? Or how long were we on this floor? Yeah, that that was a fast key get. And is that the door up there? No, that's teleporter. Slide on down. We got a walker. Also got a little worm. Ugh. Okay. I don't. I, okay, I don't want to get his attention because otherwise he won't ever come closer. Come closer. I'm gonna wanna, I'm gonna want to get the worm out of the way. Ha! They killed each other. Or did they kill each other? Or did one kill the other? No, I think they killed each other. Okay, so these worms are my are my biggest enemy right now, as far as being able to kill them without taking damage. I don't know how. I don't know how you do. Alright, that's right, I can't kill these in one hit yet. I can't do the sneaky tactic of sliding under them. This run is not going as hot as my first run, but that's okay. Oh. Because I think we can pull it back. We got a trap right here. Aha! I'm getting pretty good at recognizing the traps, except for um, the other one I had not seen quite as much. Okay, that's a completely enclosed... Oh, bummer. I guess I probably could have realized that, but... Darn. Alright, what's our next course of action then? Uh, I guess we'll go... up? I mean, the teleporters are over to the left and the right up there. But I don't care about those. Teleporters are basically useless rooms for me right now. Um, they're really only good if there's... Uh, uh, if there's... Um, if you get the key by one of them and the door just happens to be by the other one. Um, I think it'd be like... Maybe it'd be more useful if there was... If you could use the teleporter... Without activating the other one. Because right now you have to have both of the teleporters activated. If the developers are watching this at all, that is a suggestion I'm going to formally make. That would be, I think that'd be pretty cool. Or maybe, like, maybe you can, maybe I'm wrong, but we'll find out right here. Oh, we got a stalker. Okay. There's no way I could have dealt with him right now. He's a bit, I think he's a bit too strong for me. Without a upgraded weapon, for sure. 
I mean, here's the mini stalker. Or maybe, ah, what the heck? He just disappeared. I'd say maybe uh, those guys can be the stalkers. Ah, oh, I got my shield right away, awesome. Okay. Oh. Ah. Uh, they just got, like, I don't know, I'm, I'm used to five. Five is like a really normal, uh oh. Gotta go, I gotta go, I gotta go. I cannot handle him right now. Um, I mean, I probably could have. It's, it's just he's really, he's pretty tough to deal with, without, um, bombarding him and taking damage yourself. Uh, but what I was saying, the tangent before, I think those little guys are the stalkers, and then he's like a giga stalker or something, or super stalker, whatever. I almost got hit by that worm, even though I had perfect footing to attack him. Ugh, I'm enjoying this game immensely. My... Oh! Almost didn't see him in the waterfall there. Ooh. My props to the developers, seriously. I know I could hit him with only one hit and survive. Because he got poisoned twice by that thing for 20 damage. PowerPoint! Finally! You probably should have um, farmed a bit more on the first floor to get that PowerPoint sooner, but... What are you gonna do? I was nervous. Maybe we can get that spider to come down. Oh, I forgot I can do... Ah! Uh -huh. Okay, I forgot I could kill most things in one hit now. There used to be... I'm glad you can uh, pick up the key with a sword swing now. I don't think it was always like that. And um, that, was a, that was actually a big problem. Because those keys could get stuck in uh, the ceiling and stuff, and that was not good. So I'm glad that they are already fixing some butts. Fixing some butts. Stuff like that. That really, really makes me excited for the game's future. Oh, no. Not what I want. This is really dangerous, the way I'm going about this. Alright. I don't know what the green one is. I think it's maybe like 10? 10, 10 coins? I... I'm gonna be completely honest, I'm not sure what to do with coins yet. I think they're... Ah, butts. Uh, I think there might be a shop hidden somewhere. I'm gonna have to do it like this. Oh! I didn't take any damage! But I have not seen it yet. But I... That's really cool that I haven't even seen, like, a sh Oh, the shop yet. Ooh, a uh, free item room. This... Rooms that are like this that have the chest are usually just like, yep, like extra money or a potion or something. How do I get down there? Ooh. But yeah, I'm really excited for the future of this game. To see that they're already fixing like tiny little issues like that. Like, that did not happen that often, but it still was pretty game breaking. So, like, you, you literally could not continue without that key, so. Alright. I think I'm getting pretty good already, at, at least at, at the forest. When you see me go to the ice caves, I'm gonna have to, like, learn everything all over again. But, ooh, eh. That's probably my least favorite item to get, because I rarely, rarely get any, um, MP, items that use MP mana. Alright. I'm on the floor too, I have the key. Don't know where the door is. No, I do, it's up there. Do I want to farm some more? I might. There's, ah! That room over here looks pretty tough, actually. I can definitely kill this guy. Huh. But yeah, even the, like, the little worms, if you couldn't kill them in, in one hit, I would, like, I would always get hit by them. Like, just because of the, the nature of their, the way they attack. Um, but that's the reason why, um, ah, but I always get hit by the big worms. Level up. I'm not, I'm not even 100% sure what the, um, the deal is with uh, leveling up. I don't know when you get a power point. Okay, this is a dangerous place to be because ah, I thought he could jump at me. All right, do I have the other teleporter? No. Yeah, we're just um, we're grinding a bit. Ooh, nice double hit. 
Uh, come on, worm. Whoa. Okay. Yeah, I haven't expressed much interest in uh, in games like this, but uh, I am really, really interested in like like I guess unless you count Metroid as a game like this. I mean, it is in a way, but when I said games like this, I was sort of talking like games like Spelunky or Binding of Isaac. I'm really, really into those games. It's just um. And I, I've tried to record Binding of Isaac a few times, but it's just, I don't know if it's appropriate for my channel or not. I'm, I'm just not sure, because I, I, I'm, I am a bit more family friendly, and the game is not entirely family friendly. But I don't know. Maybe you guys are just like, who cares? Go for it, and stuff like that. But I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I do have a lot of fun with it though. And as for Splunky, I'm garbage at it. That's uh. That's why I haven't done that. <laughs> I'd like to get better at it. Maybe, I don't know, maybe it would be good to start a series on Spelunky and uh, show you from like rags to riches style let's play like this. Although, I don't know, maybe I shouldn't have played for the hour before because I'm not as garbage right now as I was in the, the quick look like you guys would probably expect out of this. Hmm. <laughs> thing I like about this room is wall jumping off of those. Oh, we got a walker. Ah, butts. Oh, that was close. There's a trap here. I think that is a button on the ground. Uh-oh. It looks, it looks like just a pile of leaves, sort of, but I think maybe if I didn't touch that, I'm going to give it a shot. Yep, If okay, if I didn't touch it, I'm just going to touch it, though, and get it out of the way. Ah. That was almost really bad. Uh, Alright. That was actually really almost pretty bad. Huh. We're already on floor three. Oh, look, the item room. Uh, having the damage upgrade is so, so great. Like, I almost... Ah, we got the skeleton key. I almost hate to request this, but, like, I think it almost needs to be nerfed a bit. Like, it seems like the go-to... Thing, especially right away maybe as you start to level up more it, it makes more sense okay cool oh they fixed it that way too all right so they're like there's no way you're gonna like not get the key now that's that's really good that's important very very important looks like one more level and we'll get another PowerPoint that might be good to get before we go to the boss I think that should be our goal is to get one more PowerPoint before the boss. So we can, up we'll upgrade our damage again. Normally I use, I don't know, I spend my second PowerPoint on maybe like, unusually like health, but I think that might be a bad choice. Cause I think with another PowerPoint, I am almost like certain we could beat the boss. Um, so let's go and do that before, cause we got the skeleton, we have the skeleton key. Too. We got the key and the skeleton key, so we're set for um for doors on the next floor. Like we might make it to uh, the big boss of this of the the lost jungle. That's really cool. I haven't seen him yet. That's going to be scary. Uh oh. Uh oh. Okay. Ugh. Okay. I don't want to do that yet. Like I said, I want a PowerPoint, but since I walked into the room, I activated... Okay, that's not the best way to go about this room. Huh. That was close to the best way, but I did that without, like, without any finesse. That was pretty bad. Uh-oh. <laughs> it was a tactical, tactical quicksand falling my thing. Uh-oh. Uh oh, there's two in there. Oh. I th right. We're getting there. We're halfway to the next level. Hopefully there's enough creatures on this floor. I think there is. To... to oh, no. Oh. 
I thought that oh I thought that was a one hit kill. It turns out it's just a one hit tons and tons of damage. Uh. Oh no. No. Oh, we lost one of our chances. All right, what's the situation on experience? That is important to know. Okay, we keep our experience. That might be a blessing in disguise. All right, because um the the death that is. What? Oh, okay, the shield has to be facing them. Whew. Because now we can, uh, like, almost certainly get enough experience, and we can probably do it pretty easily. We don't have to resort to the harder rooms. Also, I don't know what Joy Boy does. I've had it before, and I have no idea. Oh, God. I'm doing pretty garbage. Alright, maybe we should use our, uh, our key on this floor. Ooh! Our, uh, skeleton key, that is. Might be a good, might be a good call. PowerPoint, we got it. Alright. Hmm. That is the real, that is the real question. We have the, we have the item room already. We'd be able to kill the boss, but the thing is, do we have, like, do we have enough health where we should? I, I think, you know, I think that might be the right call. Especially since I'm doing so bad. I'm doing so bad. Okay. Uh oh. Using up my shield. Not what I want. But hey, we got some health from him. Okay, this isn't this is a trap room. Alright, we, well we got the key anyways. Let's not use the skeleton key. Ugh. I guess I don't have to, like, ri even risk it with those. I can just... Ugh. Woo. I could, uh, just jump over the button, but... I guess it... I don't know. It doesn't really matter. Do we see the room anywhere? I think that's a teleporter room down to the right. Come on. Come get me. Huh. All right, and we are at full health. If we find the boss door, I think we should just go ahead and go for it. I knew this was the teleporter. You can tell by the um, the ring of the room. And um, hmm, there's two doors on the floor, and I always got confused as to which one was the exit. But the one that is surrounded by purple is is the one you came in through. All right, I think we gotta go. Yeah, I think we gotta go over here to the left. We're doing pretty decent. We did lose more lives than I would have wished so far. Just don't make you jump, fool. Um, but I think we have a really good chance of defeating the boss, so, I mean, that's more progress anyways. That's what's important. And we want to pull this guy right here. Oh, he still got us. Is this the door? Nope, it's another teleporter. Got that activated in case for some reason we need it. Which I don't foresee that being the case. Where is this door? Have I seen it? No, it's it's got to be up here. And to the right. Whew. So how is your guys' days going? How are they going? Rather. My day's going pretty interesting. I lost an entire recording of Animal Crossing. That's... That happened a, whoa, a while ago, however. Come down here. So I'm pretty bummed about that. I think he's glitched. I think he, was, he spawned a little bit too high up or something. So I'm bummed about that. But I'm actually really excited because... Uh, I'm having more fun doing this recording right now anyways. It was, a, it was a decent recording though. It's always a real shame to lose it. Oh! All right, here's the boss door. Uh-oh. Okay. Two, three. Ah! One, two, three. Perfect. What do we have for items? 
Alright, we want to use this. I don't know what it does, though. Many good fortunes. I don't know. It Like, I spawned it before and it didn't look like it did, uh, dealt any damage, so maybe it's a healing thing? So I'm just going to plop it down and... I, you see, I don't get it. I don't get it. It's kind of terrifying. I'm really not holding out many, any high hopes for this fight right now. Oh god, especially since I'm stuck. I'm not going to deal any damage to him. Alright. Gotta sneak my way right through here. Ah, uh, okay. Like I said, I wasn't hold- uh oh. Are we out of lives? Okay, okay. This is our big attempt here. I am nervous. Uh oh. What? Spikes on the bottom there. Alright. Doing decent. Mmm. No! What are you? Oh, God. Okay. I knew that was happening. Oh, my gosh. This thing. I want to hit from the edge. Ugh. Nice. Oh, God. There's one more than I expected. Oh, no. Okay, come on. Come on forward. Oh! Oh, no. I think we were really close. I feel like we were like a hit or two away. Oh, that run was a little bit more planned out. I feel like we had a good chance. But I also feel like we blew it. Ooh, if we had the flame shield on this run, everything would have been very hunky-dory. Thank you all for watching. I feel like, even though we didn't get any further, I feel like we progressed a bit as far as, like, how comfortable I am with the game. Like, I, I, I felt like I, I learned a few things, and that's what's really important. As always, thank you all for watching. Leave a like on this video or the first video if you would like to see this continued, or if you just enjoyed the video at all. Share it with your friends. Share it with anybody you want to get interested in the game. Uh, go give it a thumbs up on Greenlight if you want to see it made into a game on Steam. I definitely suggest that. Uh, thank you all for watching. Thank you, thank you.